or our dark sides. And dozens of people have lost their jobs or not been hired because of private thoughts they expressed on this now most public of places. I heard you softly whisper. Oh, it was just dropped on me like a, a bomb. Rob Smith had a good job and a weblog, a personal website where he let it rip. What did you say? I said she had big boobs. <laughs> okay. And that was brought up at the meeting. And I shouldn't have said that. That was about a new colleague. He said worse things about his ex-wife. What did you say about her? <laughs> That's not fit for TV, most of it. No. Well, now, if it's not fit for TV, what made you think that it was fit for the blogosphere? Um, it's different. Anything goes in, in the blogosphere. It's wide open. It's like a mud rack. But in truth, anything doesn't go. Rob Smith was forced into early retirement after 23 years at chemical company Kerr McGee in Savannah, despite his excellent job performance as a supervisor. Did you have a sense when you were writing this blog that you were potentially putting your job in jeopardy? Well, I knew it. When I wrote some of the things I did, I knew it could come back and bite me. I didn't think... So you think what they did was essentially fair, then? No, I do not. I do not think it was fair at all.